this one starts off a whole new chapter in our series. It's going to seriously open up a whole set of workflow productivity options. Understanding how the new session command is critical to our adventure to Tmux glory. This one's going to open the door for some seriously game-changing hotkeys and scripting. Uh, let's let's check it out from the command line. Let's do a uh, clear, and we can run a Tmux new new sesh. Oh wow! I didn't even know that worked. I accidentally did that. New sesh works. New session works. Um, so this gives us a new session. Notice down here on my bottom left, it's named. 11 by default. Let's go ahead and detach from this one. Uh, we can do a new session and call and do a, you know, slap on a dash D on this fella. What that'll do, uh, let's do a T mux LS. Um, notice last time we had the 11, this time we've got a 12. Uh, we can throw another one in there, T mux LS, and we get a 13. This is creating a detached session. Uh, very important for scripting purposes. So we will need to know that one later. Uh, we can also name these sessions. So we can throw in a dash S me. And we are now in the me session. Uh, if we do a detach again, and we try to create another session called me, uh, we're going to get an error says duplicate session me. Uh, to get around that, we can throw in a capital A dash capital a s will attach to a session if it exists if not it will create one so here we go now we can attach to our me session we can detach we can attach we can detach we can just keep going right here from the command line attach and detach no errors and that was the tmux new session command make sure you guys check out the playlist for the Tmux series.